fellow gamers, welcome to Board Game Spotlight Live. I'm Glory Hound and this is Dr. Glory Hound. And tonight we're going to be playing Barbarians Tales of Barbaria. This is on Kickstarter right now. We already have some awesome people in chat today. It looks like Amanda Panda, which I love that name. It's perfect for this game. And Battle Crier in chat. We are very, very active with our chat. So if you have any questions about the game, make sure to let us know as we're going to be playing the game as well as talking to you guys while we're here. If you want to know how to lose, I am 0 for 3. So I will tell you, <laughs> just follow my example and you will lose every time. Guaranteed. Take it easy on Dr. Glory Hog this time. You know, Surreal. I will. I can't promise that battle cry. I cannot promise that. I all right? switched it up. We're now the Lotus <laughs> tribe. Wait, when I was Purple Lotus last time. Oh no! I'm still the same tribe. Dr. Glory Hog, do you want to tell us a little bit about the theme of this game? Essentially, you are one of the barbarian tribes, right? And you spend your summers and your fall gathering resources, kind of messing around. But right before your big nap at night, you know, for that long winter hibernation, you decide to have one last battle so that you can rock yourself to sleep knowing that you defeated <laughs> all the other bear clans. That's that's what you do. Oh, I got that upside down. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. At least have the tissues ready. That's right. When Dr. Glory Hog takes the loss so badly. <clears throat> I know, switched to the green tribe this time. <laughs> I'm blaming it on the dice, which I never do. Let's take a look so. at this green tribe. The art in this game is so cute. Like, oh, my gosh. Oh, thank you so much, Amanda Panda. <laughs> We love Tea Turtle. We have a fun time with all their shirts. They have cute shirts. Like, and so adorable. <laughs> like she said, this is on Kickstarter. It is by Greenbrier Games. And this is a prototype version, so not everything on this is final. Absolutely. And this is for, what was it, two to six players? That sounds correct. Okay. And it should last about, like, yes. 30 to 45 minutes on this. With our games, they always end up going a little bit longer because we end up talking to you guys out there. So just be aware of that. We're not going to speed through this in probably that time because we are going to basically lollygag around a little bit. So are you ready to get started, Dr. Glory Hog? I'm ready. Okay. Do we want to see what adventures we have to go on? All right. Let's go to our adventure deck. Oh, and we do need your little flag token right here on our glory track. I'm going to start as first player. And this does downsize as far as what you put out for different player counts. Since this is for a two-player setup, we're going to have less of the specialist tokens, less of the resource tokens as we go around. And we do get reinforcement dice that we can purchase. We have, oh yes, thank you. We have mercenary, fate, and empower cards that we can go ahead and purchase throughout the game for resources. And I'll go over whenever we start bidding on, on the boards, kind of how that works. And we also have... Grand offerings, which give us glory. I think that's all the things that I went over. So we're going to put out two of these adventures here. Dr. Glory Hog gave us our three starting cards that we get to choose from. And we decided since she was the last one to have honey out of a little bear container, she gets to go first. <laughs> these are just so adorable. These are so adorable. Okay, which one do I want to keep here? And some of the adventures we can go on are the honey-stained battlefield. Oh, my. And the Temple of Ursa Major. Oh. Highest strength, highest Ursa strength. Major so both of these want highest strength. Is supposed to be a bear. It's a giant bear constellation. Right. What's in the interesting sky. about this one is this one, these both this time want the highest strength, but they're only worth one glory at the end, but they give you a lot of bonus resources. Right. So these adventures we're going to go on will last through each season as we go through here. And so we're going to try to win these, but at the end of the season. Like, whoever, you get glory or you don't. This one's most flags gets one glory, most flags gets one glory on that. Okay, so we're going to roll our dice here. Ooh, that's a good one. That's a good one. I got two sixes and a one, Dr. Glory Hog. I got a six, a five, and a one. Not too bad. Now, on our boards right here, I'm going to show everyone. We have places where we can attack. We have a left and a right side. So if we were playing with more players, I could attack to my left and attack to my right. As of right now... I can only attack Dr. Glory Hog. <gasps> I know, it's so sad. How rude. <laughs> right here is going to be the little place where I put my dice for going on an adventure. This is going to be defense if I think I'm going to be attacked. And these right here have kind of requirements as far as the number of pips that you put in here for dice as you go through. But these are going to earn you the different types of resources. Now, Dr. Glory Hog and I cannot see what we're going to be bidding on or what I'm going to see what I'm bidding on, but you can't see my stuff. Like, I don't want you to know. I don't want you to know my sweet tricks I got over here. 
And the only caveat, you can usually go ahead and like place one dice per one area on here, except unless you have dice with matching pips. So like this, I could put both of them on one spot and then use those two dice, okay? So I think what I'm going to do, I think what I'm gonna do, but you had a, a five, a six, and a what? A one. A five, a six, and a one. Ah, oh, I just want so many things. I always want so many things with this, right? <laughs> All right, we're gonna try this. Are you ready, Dr. Glory Hog? Oh, I'm ready. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, you attacked me for five, what? How do you like that? <laughs> All right, so first thing Starting first, off just like coming you, in with your paws, like. Hey, I learned from watching you. <laughs> and I have the right what to bear heck? arms. Oh, you bear do? Bear arms. That's the right to bear arms, but that All was right, shady. So first we go adventuring, but you are the first player, so you choose where you're going first. I get first. to place first. Which I thought for sure there was gonna be a roll off. That's why I was like, I'm gonna go in on this attack and she's not gonna see it coming. All right, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to get some of this. I'm playing as the Ewoks. What is your tribe called? Sweet, sweet honey. I'm going to get some tribe. sweet honey. And I get two tokens for uh, this. You haven't won that yet because I could place there. We could oh, do a apologies. Roll apologies, Dr. Glorhog. You go ahead and place yours. I'm okay? not going to, though, so that's awkward. <laughs> all that built up. So go now ahead. Now that you did all those take backs and everything. All right, I'm going to put place my flag here since I won this. High strength is going to place a felt flag on here. This will cover up the two honey token, and so I will get two honey here with that. Dr. Glory Hog, what did you win on yours? Two rock. Two rock? Did I you rock. rock out? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. The jokes are just so bad. There's a lot of puns in this game. They're gonna keep coming though, I'm sorry. <laughs> Advance. <laughs> now we're going to battle for glory. All right, Dr. Glory Hog. You have five so against our two my troops, one. Right, our two troops would meet out in the middle of the battlefield. And here, ah. come, here come the Ewoks. And what you don't know is that there's four other friends. Oh, no. <laughs> You're out. Why? Yes, it is unbearable, Battle Cry. And so four get through and they're like, hey, what's up? What's going on over here? Can I have some of that glory? Oh. And so I take a glory. You do take a glory for that battle, for that wonderful win, but I also put mine right here so I could get some stones. So I would like a stone, one stone piece, and these are double-sided tokens, so you gotta make sure to place the token on the right side as you're getting it. So I take one stone. Okay, now we take all of our dice back on here. We're gonna advance, spring up one month here, and we do it all over again. It's that simple to learn. This simple to learn, my favorite part being the strategic adventure card area. Last time, you know, Amanda Panda, you did not get to see our last battle with this, and it was glorious for me. It was glorious for me. Not so much for Dr. Glory Hog. <laughs> oh, no, that was not a very good roll. <laughs> I have a four, a one, and a two. I have a five, a four, and a three. I see, I see. What are you going to do with those, Dr. Glory Hog? Do you want to tell me? Nope. Do you want to tell me? Okay. All right, fine, whatever, whatever, it's fine. I gotta go on and do this thing, and then I think I'm gonna probably do, probably gonna do some of this over here. Oh yeah, I think you should really go for that over there. And I probably think maybe some of this is in order as well. Maybe some of that too. Yeah, you should probably do some of this. I'm pretty or maybe sure some of that. this is the winning plan right here. I can barely hold in the laughter. <laughs> oh my gosh, our audience is nailing it tonight with the bear puns. <laughs> are you ready to are you ready to face the might of the Ewok tribe? Oh uh, yes. Yes, I am. I am Let's ready. Let's do it. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, no. It's not again. <gasps> oh, no. Not again. <laughs> All right. So I'm going to start off this adventure. Okay. You go on your mighty little adventure, Dr. Glory Hog. Um, it's not a little adventure. It's an average size adventure. Well, Thank you're you. going for Honey Stained Battlefield or your it Temple of Ursa Major. Average size adventure. Would you like to worship this temple or would you go like to go... I guess you're collecting honey on the battlefield. What would you be doing on the battlefield? Like... Are you just, you go over there so and start the, licking the, the honey off the The question is, is like, do I come over here and tie us up here? But then you're just going to tie us up here, and then there's two in play. 
That's oh, true. Kidding. That's true. That's true. I'm gonna do that. See what happens. Oh, choices, choices, choices. Oh, this is gonna be this is gonna be rough. Okay, okay, this. okay. The board. I affair. think let's get let's get some Let's faith. get it started in here. Let's get some faith. I will not apologize for my singing. You're welcome. <laughs> Hello, James. How are you doing today? James, the haircut. So what do you do with the resources, asks Amanda Panda. You so, can buy mercenary yes. cards, faith cards, empowered or from the empowered deck. What else can you do? You can also go ahead and purchase specialist tokens, which are going to help you guard your base, or they're going to give you resources as you go throughout the game. They're like an automatic resource button here. And one of the most important things that you can do with your resources is get reinforcement dice. This makes it so you get these dice and you can start rolling with them. Which, if you're familiar with any type of worker placement game, it's just going to be more workers, essentially. More bears, the better. You want more bears. <laughs> All right, now we have our battle with this. So, I have two. I have four. Oh, so my goodness. Again. I also have this lovely card right oh, here. No. The Baronator. And the Baronator says, one guard bear specialist gains plus four strength to attack or defense. And I'm going to use... Let for an attack, Dr. Glory Hog. Just a little, just a little, you know, you didn't okay. realize I had the Baronator over here whenever you were attacking me. Did so, you? I'll be back. <laughs> All right, this means war. All right. All right. So, I didn't want to have to do this. I'm going to have to go up one glory for nope, this. This is happening here. <laughs> All right, you want to mess around? I'm going to take this face paint from when I was in the army 15 years ago. This is happening. I don't even know if it's going yeah. on. Do you, or do you feel like that's going to empower you this with is like some skills? This is helping. Well, it's helping you look a little greener. And maybe you should have gone with brown so you could have looked like more bearish. No, I'm the green tribe. Oh, oh. This My is, bad. Gosh. My bad, Dr. Glory Hog. Do you not even know what tribe I'm part of right now? All right. I'm going to go ahead and now take my faith token here. And these tokens right here, once they're out, it's really important that you get like your first player that you get them when you can because once they're out they're out like you just cannot claim those once they're out there and they do size up for different games and everything but right. i feel like they're so limited they're so limited like ooh, you can you can run out very easily so since i'm the first player i ended up getting one honey okay one i'm honey. gonna go ahead and spend these okay oh and, and you're I'm, gonna get your reinforcement i'm gonna go right ahead away. and recruit a little baby bear dang it I was close, but you know what? You messed me up on my combination here, and I didn't. I was unable to get the resources I wanted for this. I'm so sad. I am not sorry. Uh, you... You have beat me in this game, like, <laughs> by five points, which is a lot. Are you back for bear blood? Is that what you're trying to say? Does this look like I'm joking around? <laughs> I don't put on war paint for nothing. <gasps> All right. That was fantastic. So we now move up one more here, and this is our third round. So after this, we decide who has won on these cards here, which that's the big thing. Y'all are so funny, right? I'm going to go ahead and that's hire what I'm saying. Paula the Polarizer. She's going to join my crew for this. What? I'm going to temporarily grab this bad boy right here. So I'm rolling five die on this last round. This is not going well for me, everyone. This is not going well at all. I'm... Hey, it only takes you beating me three Yikes. times for me to learn how to how to play. Yikes! This is not. I learned it from watching you. Oh, Six no. is oh, six. No. Oh five, no! Five, two, one. Oh no! Oh no! That's not good. And this is all sorts of not good, everyone. Participation trophies can still be collected at the end of the match. This is not good at all. Okay, so Doctor Glory Hog is at a really really big advantage Don't for worry. this I and can getting, still mess it up <laughs> and, and getting glory in this like because I messed it up I'm last time to, we did this I'm going to have to change my strategy here we're going to have to change our strategy a little bit I I mean, let me look at my tokens, but don't look at my tokens, Dr. Glory. I think your strategy is just fine only I'm, I can look at my tokens at if this, this point. was a co-op game, you'd be killing it it's not though, so you should probably you know, do something alright, so you had a 6, a 6 and what else? A five. A five. A two and a one. And a two and a one. Yeah, basically, I just. Oh, no. My barbarian tribe just starts slapping people good around. For the, for the glory hound tribe at all. The fire tribe is going down. <laughs> Listen, all right, so fire is destructive, right? You can't stop the power of creation. And that's what my tribe brings to the, to the table, is the power of creation. I'm like 
like, what is it, Nefertiti and Moana over here? Don't mess around. All right, and because of my dice rolls, these getting these resources here is really interesting because it does limit me because for some of them, you can only do four, five, and six. Yeah. And then some of them here, you can do one through five on this one here. And then on this one here, it's only one, two, and three. So you, although you can get resources as you're going through, like James my rolls tough. were just not good. James <laughs> knows that my girl is tough. Tough is the best bender on all of Avatar. Tough is, is really good. She is yeah. the best. We, we actually were we're at the last 30 minutes of the very last episode of book three right now. We've been watching a lot of The Last Airbender, everyone. If you Avatar, haven't seen it, the last. yeah, so good. So good. All right, Dr. Glory Hogg, are you ready? I'm ready. Let's do it. For the resolution. You ready? This Pull. Battle. Three. Two, one. Whew. Big shocker there. <laughs> All right, so you place first, but you don't have an adventuring tribe, so I'm going to go here and here. Okay, and I then figured that would happen. I'm going to come over here and be like, Rampage! <laughs> and gave myself a glory, which it's I like so that sad. this actually, this is still a lot friendlier than before, where I used to actually physically take a glory oh, from yeah. you. Oh, yeah, no, absolutely, absolutely. The regular barbarians was like that. And then we would go ahead and go <laughs> into our resources. So I would collect, or you'd collect first, because you're technically first player. Would, may the panda spirit be with you both. Can, Amanda, can just the panda spirit be, just be with me, please? Please. A I'd moderate like to amount of panda like spirit <laughs> can be with you. Okay, and then like the, a minimal. Like, no, no, but no, like a minimal with a you. maximum amount of panda spirit no, for me. No, no, I'm Listen, not down I with that. I need this one. <laughs> it's my birthday in a week. Can't you give this one to me? So, oh, that is good. I like that you can just gain glory and can you steal resources? Yes, you can, but mm -hmm. only through cards. Yeah. So I have done it before. I did that on our live stream before, and it was... It takes, like... It was an ultimate betrayal. She was like, curse you and your inevitable betrayal. That's just because you made it so I couldn't get reinforcements at the time whenever uh -huh. it happened. So it was like a key move. But in the, in to the... balance things out, like a true airbender, I did allow you to beat me by, like, six points. So Oh, well, that was you, you really that nice going of you. On. That was really nice of you. Okay, I'm going to take two of the honey, and yes, I'm going to so take... so Successful Geek, this one, with this, it adds, like, an area control mechanism in the middle, and then you've got a bigger variety of cards. And when you take when you win a battle, it doesn't feel as bad because the other person just gains glory. It's not as it's not as rough. Yeah, you know, absolutely successful geek. I feel like this one here, although you do have the battling, it is much less intense. And really, the biggest way to get glory in this game is going to be in this adventuring area here because these cards become so so important. And this is actually like an area control game within this worker placement or this dice placement game in this. So this was my favorite edition of this. It is so good. If you loved Barbarian Battlegrounds, like this is this is it right here, okay? <laughs> I should probably actually put these down, huh? Yes, absolutely. Take those so and rock, take your resources. And so I'm gonna get rock and I'm actually gonna get honey. Rock and honey, okay. Rock and honey. Now, you've collected all of your stuff, right? Uh, no, I need to still get one more honey and one more faith. Okay. Oh my gosh, she's going to get so many things. <laughs> this is not good. I got distracted. I've never been in the lead before. Oh my gosh. Dr. Glory Hog. <laughs> but I lose this mercenary. You do. They are gone. Um, and then we would go ahead and, yep, we want to. We want to resolve these cards since it is the last month of spring here. So what we're going to go ahead and do is just look at the flags here. Dr. Glory Hog has claimed this one. And at the end of the season, the most flags is going to gain one glory. As well as this one here, and the most flags is going to gain one glory. So Dr. Glory Hog is killing it this season. No, there's no killing. This is just fun. Well, we're, just, we're just battling for fun. <laughs> You're getting all the glory this season. It's very unfair. I'm not a fan. <laughs> I like to call everything worker placement. It makes people really mad. Like, technically, my job is worker placement. This is technically, I don't know. I'm going to have it's to go It's dice back. placement. It's, well, it's dice placement. It is. It's. It's different, but the same. You're is still it, placing things for action. Is it like <laughs> worker placement? Hey, what's going on, board game closet? Oh, my goodness. Now, with these tokens here, I get to purchase things first. Yep, you are so first. So I think I would like to purchase some things. Feel free I mean, to there are some, some things. things that I would definitely like to purchase more than others, but... Please, this is a PG-13 show. Ah, I think I'm just kind of one away from everything I want, actually. Hmm. Because I was going to go for some specialist tokens, but I do need one of each. And I'm just so short on stone right now. Like, that is just not good. Okay, I'm not going to purchase anything. Are you going to purchase anything before I flip these over? No, I'm good. 
I feel healthy and happy with this. <laughs> I work for a marketing software company and feel like I do there engine you building. You absolutely do successful, Geek. Like, yeah. that is 100% some engine building, okay? <laughs> so for this one here, and we're going to move into summer here. So we have the Rowdy Tavern. And at the end of the round, whoever has the highest strength places a flag. This one is also highest strength places Ooh. the flag. This is the Baroness's Tower. This one, however, is going to give you three glory, and this one is going to give you one glory at the end. This three one's going to give you a bunch of resources, though, or this one's going to give you less. Uh, like, one of these true. is an empty spot, even. That's true. So, there is that. There is that trade-off. Ooh, okay. But I need to roll. I need no to roll well. Right I need to roll well, everyone. All right, you need to roll moderately okay. I need to roll so I wish fantastical. You, I wish you an adequate amount of luck so that you feel like you're still in the running, <laughs> but still ultimately lose. <laughs> You're so sassy today, Dr. Glory Hog. Uh, you were sassy when you were beating me, wasn't it? <laughs> were you doing this the whole time? I was. I was doing little prancy feet, and it was working for me. It was working for me. <laughs> so I got a small straight, so I'm going to put that down it's under my small straight on Yahtzee. Yahtzee. Mm -hmm. There you go. <laughs> so five, four, three, two. And you got a five, five two, two, and, and a one. one. I am first player. You sure are. So we would actually technically, I would have to place first. Yikes a doodle. Interesting, interesting. Okay. Ooh, choices. Choices, 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 everyone. I don't know how this is going to go. The cocoa bow? Pretty much. You can get there fast and then I'm going to take it slow. That's fair. <laughs> That's what I would do too. All right, we're going to do this. All right, I'm ready. Are you ready? I'm not ready. Are you ready? I am mildly ready. Three. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. Oh, two. No. no, don't. No pressure. No pressure. No pressure. One. No, 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 no. Analysis process. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Okay, okay. AP is over. Three, AP is over. Two. <laughs> one. The flags, Amanda, are just there to notate which re that you won them certain rounds, and then whoever has the most flags on there or the most of these tokens here is going to be the winner of that. The winner and of that adventure. Does the different colored dice have different pips? No, they do not. They all have the same amount of pips. It's just that these particular dice right here... Are mercenary dice. Right. So th they can be used by anybody, and usually they're going to come from the mercenary deck right they're here. They're one-time use. You use them for one turn. Absolutely. Whereas the colored ones, all of these colored ones are for each different faction that we have here because you have six different factions. Right. So you could be, if you're playing with six players, they would all be out. Absolutely. And that, that means that's the maximum amount of dice you can have every single turn. Oh, you went low too? I did. Oh so my goodness. I place first. I'm going to go, I think, here. And I'm going to okay. take a faith token. Okay. We're going to go here and we're going to take. So much stone. <laughs> We're going to take all this stone over here. We need this stone so badly. So badly. Okay. We go to battle. I have five. You do have five, so you take your glory, Dr. Glory Hall. You take your glory. I shall. Thank you. And I hope it was worth in it. the end you, you fail. You wow. fail. And then I'm going to go ahead and take <laughs> a faith, which I'm just going to flip one of these over. Okay. And then I'm going to go ahead and take a stone, one stone. Okay. So I'm going to take a honey right here and I'm going to take a stone as no. well and that is all the tokens so I would go ahead and get to purchase first yes so I'm gonna go two 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 so I'm gonna drop those bad boys back and I'm gonna get my last die recruit one more baby bear go ahead if you would like okay I'm gonna purchase. use these ones here and I'm gonna get one of my dice get my first die my first extra reinforcement, because my bear clan needs some help over here, everyone. I'm my bear make... clan is not doing well. Did you turn in your stuff? Yep. I did turn in my I'm going to make a second purchase now. Okay. Since you made your purchase, I'm going to go ahead and purchase the blacksmith. So this blacksmith specialist is just going to give me one stone each turn. Very nice. Very nice. So that's like a bonus resource, basically. And then I'm actually going to use, all because I had all my resources, and I was basically just missing stone. So that was holding me back that last turn. So I actually am going to purchase my other reinforcement die. Oh, wow. Yeah, you were just... I was just... I had one stone, and I was able to get all three this last turn. So I was like, oh, yeah. Can I just say, for 15 years, this face paint still worked. That's... <laughs> 15 years in an Arizona garage. <laughs> I'm just, I'm surprised it, it still went on. All right, face. so hopefully I can make some stuff up now because of this. 
I think I like to think you make up a lot of stuff when we play games. I, I try to make up some stuff. I mean, it keeps things entertaining, um, right? I'm gonna admit, I did not want you to uh, automatically catch up to Just me. Just get pimple boom. Are you ready? All my bears got my bears. I Are feel you like ready? We need some like bear rap music. No. That's what that is. No. Are you ready for this? That's... <laughs> we need bear rap music as we're doing this. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Oh my. Oh my goodness. I needed some, some extra shakes twos. because like yours some were really good. Twos. I hope. Boom. That you get below twos. I got no. six. Oh, you got twos a as four, well. A three and twos. Okay. So the question is, since Ooh, you're the first player, this is gonna are you going to drop the six and guarantee that you get a spot here, or are you going to drop the two twos and then try to split mm, or do two drops on that's there? That's going to be interesting. That's going to be interesting, right? Because I don't have to use my six. Because doubles wise. Mm -hmm. But I could. Or here's the other thing, everyone. Triples wise. Here's the other thing. If I pl I could place all three of my twos on there, you could, and then force like a roll off if I put my if six you there. Pu if you put your six there, and then like with your twos and stuff like that, like, or if you decide to put your twos on there, then it becomes like a mess on how we are gonna like allocate things in here, and that's mighty exciting for me. Not that I'm saying I'm gonna put all my twos together, Dr. Glory Hog. No, no, not saying that I'm, I'm just gonna be up. stacking these up. I'm right just gonna get on my horse and right away. <laughs> Dr. Glory Hog, it's fine. This is fine. This is fine. Okay? What else did you have besides a six and three twos? I had a six, a five, and three twos, Dr. Glory Hog. This is where it gets interesting. It's mid game. This is getting interesting right here, okay? Is it getting interesting right now? It is getting. Oh my god. Real interesting. I did not expect you to say that right now. <laughs> this has gotten interesting. All right. I also want to do some stuff with some things, I think. Yeah, I'm covering up because I know she can look at the camera. <laughs> Don't you look at the camera. I wasn't looking at the camera. You just looked up when I said that. Well, I was looking at our chat. I mean, that's different. It's totally oh, yeah. different, Dr. Yeah, Glory Are you ready? I. Three. And mildly ready, two, but I guess this will work. One, we'll see. go. Ooh, you did do the stack. Oh, oh, we both did it. Oh, we tied up. This is going to be real interesting to see what happens. Okay. All right, place your dice. Ooh, I get to place my dice. So you have two twos. Mm -hmm. All right, so when you have multiple dice like this here, can I can put them. all of them here. I can put two over here. I can put any dice anywhere. And if I end up winning this, Say I win with these three, I get to put all three flags on here. As opposed to if I did this and say I won this, I could put two flags and so on. Like it matters. It really, really matters. You where can I'm basically gonna place these. with the three, you can pick which one of those you're gonna for sure win. But then you're giving me the other one. Top Absolutely. Of Depending on how I place, maybe I'll just split them up and take nothing from both sides. What? Force a roll off for no reason. Yeah, you know, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna put all three over here. Okay, that's We're fair. We're going to put all three over here because I feel like three glory in the long run. I think that's where it's at, everyone. Well, we'll I need see. to catch up. I need those three glory points, okay? All right, so go ahead and collect your resources. So you're going to get okay, two I'm gonna honey? Okay, I'm going to get two honey for, for that. I'm assuming. because you. And I get to place three flags on here. Mm -hmm. And the, the nice thing about that is it didn't actually lock this up. There is still one more spot here. You could still tie this if you wanted to. Well, I could deny you from it, but I don't have another flag to place. Oh, that's true. But I could deny it from Dr. Glory Hog. You would never. You no, wait, I couldn't not. technically deny it. No, I could. If I, As long as I deny it, I would win it because you couldn't place a flag on it, and that would be my flag. You better not. Ooh. Ooh so good. Deny him, says Board Game Closet. Wow. <laughs> see? They just want to see you denied up here. <laughs> that got intense. Oh, no. So I'm going to take. Oh, that's right. You're going to put two faith. flags. You're going to put two flags on there. That's not going to be helpful two at all. Two faith and two honey. From there. All right. oh, okay, okay. So we go to battle, though, interestingly enough. Which is a six and a six. Okay. So we tie it up. With this, if you ever tie for any reason, if we tied on here where we had both, oh, right. we have both to roll of off, these, huh? yeah, we have to roll off. And we would actually roll all the dice involved. So if Dr. Glory Hog had a six and put it here, and then I had all three, I would roll all three of my dice. So it does give me an advantage for having more dice on there, but it is still a roll off. And I do want to do one caveat. This is still a prototype game, so rules could potentially change. Absolutely. So before you know, before you look at this as your how to play, this is more of a how much fun is this game. <laughs> That's what I call you. Ready? 
Okay. Roll. Oh, I don't want to. I'm so Roll. nervous. Do I'm it. so nervous. Roll I'm so nervous. Roll. Okay. Oh, why? Why do bears suddenly oh. appear when there's glory to take home? Give me that dice. Give me that dice, they Dr. Glory to Hog. Me. All right. Now, yep. And resources then, wise. Yes, so you would collect first. So what do you have? Just a I'm stone? I'm going to have a stone. I want a stone. I'm going to get one of everything because I've got one there, one there, and one there. So what I'm going to go ahead and do with that, it is so your turn unfair. to purchase. So unfair. I don't have anything that I think I want to. Well, maybe I do want to purchase something. I think I'm going to purchase something from the mercenary deck over here. I'm going to Try purchase one die. of these cards and we'll see. Ooh. Ooh. This is okay. I'm going to show our audience this card. All right, I'll look down. I'll cover my ears. Look at mm -hmm. that mm -hmm. card. Ooh, mm -hmm. I am so excited mm -hmm. about using that. What do you guys think? Oh, this is going to be exciting. Okay. Um, I hope that. that all right, nothing to see here, Dr. Glory. Hug. I hope all the noises I made made it very easy for no one else to be able to hear anything. Nothing to see here. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and make my purchase since I am a second player. All right. I'm going to go ahead and purchase. This stone. You got this. So I want this stone. Now I'm going to take actually the village elder. All right. So that is. Well, this is this is going to be the final round of this. I'm just going to also purchase this. Oh what? And then I'm what? also going to go ahead and purchase what? this. No. Doctor Glory Hogs. No. <laughs> <laughs> I did not approve of any of that. <laughs> Oh, no. I am not a fan. Oh, no. I am not a fan of what just yeah, happened there. Yeah, I know what you're up to Everyone, over here. Everyone, I'm going to need some, some, some very, very good luck, some All moral right, so support. All right, so it's getting time to roll. Do you have anything you need to do? Because I'm going to go ahead and hire the Ursa the Miner and go ahead and pick myself up another die. So I'll be rolling six die. That's right. You need two hands to count how many I've got. Five. I'm gonna six, hold on to this card. Six die. I'm gonna hold on to it. I'm gonna hold on to it. This is the last round. I'm not holding on to this. Well, I gotta win. Last that. round of summer. There's still autumn. I could come back in the fall. I could make a big comeback in the fall, okay? Could happen. Six, five, five, four. Ooh. Not two, good. One. Not good, everyone. That's all I needed was that one six, because I can just go but not good. Okay. I'm definitely gonna get that. All right, uh, so I have two fours, a one, a two, and a five. Okay. Got it? Mm hmm Ah, two fours, a one, a two, and a five. There we go. You need to make sure you put the dice behind there and they don't flop around. That would be not be good. Not be good. You don't want All floppy right. dice. <laughs> Agreed. What do I need, everyone? You need to have faith, faith, faith. You got to have faith, faith, faith. Baby. I think that... I came this time, like... You came really super prepared, Dr. Yes. Glory Hogger. Well, I'm really impressed with you. three times in a row. And then you're like, no, 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 this isn't happening again. I mean, I brought face paint. <laughs> so, obviously, I knew that what was going to happen. I knew I needed to bring my A game, because this is the first time we've me... actually done this on Board Game Spotlight. So oh, that's I, true. I wanted to make sure that they could see that I can actually win games. You want... <laughs> and then they can go to the Glory Hound channel if they want to see me lose this game. So, you have the option. And this is the musical version of Barbaria. That's right. Well, well. That'd be nice. We can't help it. We Wouldn't the world be it. a little bit better place if it was always a musical, though? That would With kind of With the right music? True. Come on. As you're on your way to commute, people just get out of their cars and start dancing. And, but you still show up to work on time. It's like that singing in the rain. Well, nobody would be upset about that. Yeah, because you boss, just, like, dance right. into work. You'd be like, just dancing into work. You would, you would get like, to work and your boss is like, hey, you're a little bit late. And you'd be like, I don't want to work. <laughs> I just want to bang, and he'd start banging on the drums. The next thing you look back and be like, "Who's late now, Rick?" That's true. That's true. And Who's then late now? nobody's nobody's upset. I, I just mean... called him out on camera. <laughs> yeah, that's right. No one's late now. Are you, you ready? Are you ready to reveal? Boom. Interesting. So I'm gonna get this adventure. Okay. I should be first player. Sorry. So that'll give me these two that's rocks. That's right. And then we go to battle, and I'm bringing with me. Oh, you're bringing ten. ten. And how many did you bring to your battle? I brought eight. Oh, no. That is not good. So I would still get through, and I would get you one You would glory. still get through. Then we would go earn here. earn all the glory in this next round, everyone. So here I'd get one honey. One two honey. Two faith and two stone. Okay, and I'm just going to get one of all of the things here. 
what one one uh, maybe okay and one so this blacksmith the village elder really helped me out because they gave me some extra stuff okay how much resource are you sitting on there you got one two three four I five just got, uh, i got a little one one and one 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 all right so that was it so we have to do this don't we uh yes and we also have to buy. So from here, okay. you're going to gain one glory here for having less fives. And I'm going to gain three glory here. Yep. So one, two, three. Which does Still make it a lot Still a bit closer. of a gap, but it does make it a, quite a bit closer. I think if this particular round, if I can win some really great adventures, I can definitely come through this. I can definitely make it through this. Like, take, no I problem. Up, I pick up this glory one. No. Yeah. I've right. done that before. <laughs> All right, so I get to decide if I'm going to make any purchases first, correct? Yes, you get to decide if you're making purchases first. Man. Well, this is intense. It's intense, this last round. I'm going to spend one of everything. So I'm going to drop this down one. Okay. I'm going to drop this one down one, and actually that one's going to actually that. go in. And I'm going to buy this. I'm going to get myself some, a beekeeper. All right, I'm going to turn I don't own in. the beekeeper. The beekeeper works for me one of all of these things here and i'm gonna get one of these right here so i have a village elder a beekeeper and a blacksmith Aww. and you've got a guard on guard i got a little tiny guard over here for no reason no reason don't worry about that dr glory hog don't worry about and i'm that. actually going to go ahead and turn this one in and pick up an empower card oh that's fancy we're going to turn out we have the barren battlefield which highest strength places a flag, and then most flags is going to gain two glory. And we have the Who Man Hideaway. Highest strength places the flag. I'm so sad there was no lowest strength places the flags yeah, during this Yeah, because there demo. are some in there. Yeah. And it makes it really weird where you're like, okay, it's well, do so I want to go low or do I want to go high? But this one also is going to give you two glory. So that's four potential glory out there True. that I can make up. The All right. Barbar All right. The Baron Battlefield. All and I the need is Human. some decent rolls, everyone. You All get, I need. You get that it is the Human Hideaway. Human. Uh, I the, did not realize it's where the that. Human, because it's a tent and a campfire. It's a little Human Hideaway. It's where the Humans hang it's out. It's where they hide out. It's where the Humans hide. Okay. That's fine. It's Ooh, fine. Ooh, girl. Oh, you got a nice little six okay. yourself. So we got a six, two threes, a four, and a one. I've got a six, a three, a two, two, and a one. All right. Hmm. Hmm. The choices. The choices. Let me see. You're you're placing first, right? I am placing first, Doctor Gloryhog. Would you care to discuss your strategy with me before I would you care place not them to. down? Thank you. <laughs> you wouldn't care to discuss exactly what you're gonna do. Are you uh... sure? You sure? Is on my side. Yes, it is. All right, everyone. Ooh, I just thought about that. What were your What were your doubles again? Uh, two threes. I have a six, two threes, a one, and a four. Ugh, gross. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> I, I I'll tell you honestly. I was gonna drop my twos onto my adventure because I was like, oh yeah. But then if if you see that I've got twos there, you could just spread out and then take both, and I would be sad. So, yeah. That's not going to work out the way I want it to. Hmm. Hmm. It becomes very tactical at this point, huh? No. Dr. Gorthog. Yes. If you could just stop hitting me with your bears in the face, that would be awesome. You ready? <laughs> okay. Excellent. Place first. Alrighty then. Alrighty then. So, I think that I'm going to place... You still did good. Overall, this is still a better win for you. Or a better move. I'm going to go ahead and place like this. I know. I know. Dr. Glory Hog right now is wondering why the heck I did that. Go ahead and place, Dr. Glory Hog. Go ahead and place, Dr. Glory Hog. Place your die. Place. Oh, you want that card? You want that card? You want the card? You can't have that card because I have a spy there. And this spy has made it so I get to remove one adventuring die of a five or six from any player. It has been removed, sir. Okay. 
And then I'm going to go happy ahead. with yourself? I am happy with I am myself. Here. I'm so happy right now, everyone. Do you think I'm you're going to be happy after I play these two cards? Oh, no. Why? What are those two cards? Think about it. <laughs> All right, so we go to the attack phase. I only have four, so you will actually get through. Okay, so I'm going to go up one there. Yep. For that. I'm going to get two honey, two well, One second here. Dr. Gorehog, since I'm first player, I want to place my flags and make sure I grab tokens before you pick them up. There just in case. should be enough. Okay, I just wanted to make sure. I think I will take two of these stones. What is up, Julie? And I'm going to also take, I'm gonna take a faith, I think. I'm not losing, Julie. Feel, <laughs> feel free to rewind to find out why. And I'm going to take a faith on that one there. So I placed on there and there. Okay, and then I'm gonna go ahead and take another faith right there. Oh, you're gonna need the faith. I'm gonna need all the faith. You good? <laughs> all right, I think there. I am good. There, and one there. So actually, I'll just flip this one over to it too. I think what I'm going to do. And then I get to purchase first on this. Mm -hmm. So purchasing wise, I'm gonna take these. I'm gonna take another guard. Okay. Because I need to stop the bear bleeding happening here of Dr. Glory Hog constantly hitting me with his bears, okay? I'm going to also spend... Oh, Julie is very proud of you, Dr. Glory Hog. One of, that means so much. <laughs> I'm going to also do the same thing. I'm going to spend one of each to go ahead and get myself a guard. Wow. Wow. So rude. All right, Julie, you going to buy anything else? No, that is all I'm going to buy. I oh, no, wait. Go maybe ahead. I'm going to buy something else. What is the fate... Do again, it's going to be where you're going to be rolling after rolls. You get to do stuff. You don't have enough faith to buy. You have enough stone. Oh, no, stone. And power. So that would be the empowerment. I'm going to buy faith. Faith, faith, faith. I'm going to mm, buy faith. I don't faith, like you faith, having faith, so faith. many cards over there, Dr. Glory Hog. You got to use your bare hands in this game, it seems. That's right. You got to, like, true. give it your all. You and you're a successful give a little dude, growl. so you know that's true. <laughs> you got to give a little growl at your opponent, okay? <laughs> Let's see here. All right. We only have two rounds left in this. Two rounds left. I really need to make this happen. And I really need to make this happen. Personal. I should have bought a card, I think. Too late. It's not going to be good. You ready? We're going to see. <laughs> Come on. Let's roll high. Let's roll high. Let's do this. I like it whenever we have the low, roll low cards because I'm just like, for the most part, I'm the worst roller usually. Like, where the so rest of your die? I'm trying a different rolling strategy here right now, okay? <laughs> I'm trying a different rolling strategy to hopefully give me the one up on things here. All right. Well, All right, so I'm going to play marginal, a card. More, we'll see. I'm going to re-roll any one of your opponent's die. I hope you roll me a six. Dang it. So I used because, because All I right. can. All right. So you have two fives, a three, a two, and a one. Correct. I got two ones, a six, a four, and a two. Okay. Okay. I think I know what I need here. I think I know what I need to do. Gonna do some of this. We're going to do some of this. We're going to do some of this. We're going to do some of that over there. We're going to put one over there. And we're actually going to give this one a little twirl and put it right there. How do you feel about that, Dr. Glory Hog? I'm ready. You ready? <laughs> Even a blind bear finds a picnic basket <laughs> once in a Whoa, while. Oh, that'll cry. Wow. Well, I mean, Jeez. bears do have really good little snooters. Wow. So, I like... feel like that was directed at me. <laughs> you ready? <laughs> Three. All right. Two, one. Do you have some nefarious sort of plans going on, Dr. Glory Hog? Place your dice, sir. I'm looking to see what you might want. So you've got yourself a little bit of... Whoops, well, it's two glory and two glory. Right, right. Right, right. But I have a feeling you want mercenaries more than anything. But there's only also one more round. So I'm going to actually just place here. Okay. Yeah, there is only one more round. This is tough. This is what All you right, call... All right, we're going to go ahead and place that there. Suboptimal. So I'm going to go ahead and get 
and get a double honey. Honey bunch I is about. I need, I need, where's my flags? Why do I have one of your flags over here? Get your flag out of here. Careful. Geez. Get your flag out of here, Dr. Glory Hog. Be gentle. We're going to take, I guess we're going to take one of these. We're going to take another fate. Hopefully this fate will help me in the long run with my fate. You can also offer up seven resources to just straight out gain. What are you are you buying right now? No, I just I just put my flag down. Oh, okay. Sorry. I just put my flag down. All right, you ready to do the fight? All right, battle. Four, five, six, seven. I didn't even look and see what you had. Three, four, five. You're not gonna do anything? <gasps> I thought I was gonna get wrecked right there. <laughs> I would never <laughs> wreck, you, wreck you. I thought I was going to get wrecked right there still. Oh my gosh. I'm catching up though. I'm catching up. It's getting close. All right. And then Dr. Lorehog, did you take your resources that you needed? I did. All right. I'm going to go ahead and take a honey and I'm going to take a faith token. And I'm going to go ahead and start purchasing. So I'm going to purchase a mercenary. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and purchase Fate, a Fate card, I think. Oh, I like that. I like that. I'm going to show our audience, too, so they can see what I have down to the line here. Hopefully, that'll help out, especially whenever, like, I rolled, like, something like this. That is, yeah. I mean, this card is very powerful, and it's going to really help me out, Dr. Glory Hog. I'm and going to go and buy another mercenary. Card. I was going to say, I'm, I'm looking at what I want to get. I mean, heck, at this point, I think it's almost worth it to just try and get stuff. Since, because I feel this has been a really very bloody battle. Like, very bloody battle. It's not been good. It's not been good. You're barely <laughs> holding on. I am barely holding on, like, by. By a little tiny claw at this point. Please show me your card. <laughs> this is the last round, and I have four cards, Julie. It's, I'm going okay. all in. You are going all in. It's making me really nervous, Dr. Glory Hog. I need to roll all sixes. All sixes. All right, please. you place first this please, time. Please, thank you. Uh, before we start the battle, I am going to go ahead and hire Smokey the Solid. Smokey the Solid. <laughs> he owes me, and you know he owes me. I'm clawing my way back. That's right, Battle Cry. I'm clawing my way back up to this glory track, okay? That's a good start. That's not what I wanted. Da, da, that's a lot of ones. I Ooh. hope you keep all the ones. Can you imagine if I just took all those ones and just like, just took a whole thing? What do you mean? Just, what do you got? What do you mean? So what got is this? Four, two, two, three, two. So you've got three twos, and I have three ones. So I can reroll any of my dice once, which I think I'm going to go ahead and do right now. Okay. Although I would like to place all these here, Dr. Glory Hog just has far too many really high dice. Should I just chance it? Okay, chat. Should I chance it and just roll, re-roll all my dice? Because all of my dice are really low. Or should I at least keep like one or two of these? I need to know. Because she needs to know. This is gonna this is gonna tip the entire game right here. If I win these two cards. That's probably going to put me over Dr. Glory Hog, and then it would be pretty hard for Dr. Glory Hog to pull out the win on this. Yeah, see, yeah, that is not helpful. <laughs> not helpful right now. That's a six on your twos in Yahtzee. That's not bad. But. But. but I mean. Everyone's got a furry bear butt. Because I'd basically be rolling to just try and. I'm definitely Beat rolling the twos. At least. You gonna reroll all those twos? Heart the card. Heart of the cards. Oh wait. <laughs> I definitely want to roll the twos, but I'm wondering if I should roll the four and the three. I don't know. Because you have a six and a five, so yeah. I feel like overall. You should probably do something though. Our That's what I would not, do. Our chat's not. Why are they gonna help you? Answering me. I need help, everyone. <laughs> they, they literally can't help you. All right. I think. 
I'm going to re-roll all of them. Ooh, go ahead. I feel like it can't get much Four, worse three, than this. Two, two, two. Famous last words. Famous last words. Yeah, with right your there, dice right? rolling, you, it could definitely get Famous worse. Famous last words. We're going to see. We're going to see. You've declared all, though. I have declared all of the re-rolls. <laughs> All of the re-rolling. I'm going to need some room. I'm going to need some re-rolling room, okay? It's all or nothing in this. Well. The five is technically better five so Five is far. technically a little better, okay? Okay? Ooh. That two and one are not better. No. You got your twos back. Oh, no. Sending me six vibes, Amanda Panda. Thank you. Yes, Amanda Panda. Yes. Where were you like one round ago? Oh my goodness, thank you. I'm gonna reroll all my dice once by using <laughs> no hairy situations. <laughs> I'm gonna reroll my ones. That was my fate card. <laughs> oh no, Dr. Glory Hog! That's how you reroll dice. That's how. So that's a four of a kind. I just wanna get my bare hands on you right now. <laughs> Oh my. What the heck? <laughs> Let me just stack these bad boys up. Oh no, I'm so upset. You got four or five? Yeah. Yikes. I don't think there's anything I can do with that. I don't think so either. Oh no, that didn't go well, so Julie. No, I don't think that went well. <laughs> So much drama for oh, your no, mama. I missed, I missed which one I had. Which one did I have? I had a one, a two, a two, right? Two twos, I think. And a two, one. Two? You had two two? I think so. A two, oh two. my goodness. What you gonna do? You got no way out. What you gonna do? Oh, this no. is not going well. Okay. Take a look. It's in a <laughs> book. Reading Rainbow. And I'm not going to be able to make up any glory with ha getting extra tokens and stuff. If I hadn't have gotten the cards, it would have been different, I think. Oh, no. I think I'm just... No, I don't think this is going to work out. Okay. Okay, yeah. I don't think this is going to work out, so we're just going to do this. We're just going to do this. And we're going to do... <laughs> and we're just going to do some of that. We're going to do some of that. Why not? Why not? Ready? <laughs> Three. <laughs> Two. Yes. Amanda, the cards are super important for dice mitigation, especially if you're super terrible at rolling. But also, what we you didn't see during this is that... A lot of times you'll have adventure cards that have the lowest wins instead. Absolutely. And, and so that makes it weird. You're like, do I want to take the high one or the low one? Right. The six cards that we pulled from this deck here, which is quite large, just happened to, we just happened to not have any of those in here with our last games. I think we've seen one, more than one, every single game. Yeah. So I was surprised when we only had these ones. Like, I kept on waiting for the lowest card ones, or the lowest die rolled ones to come up. And they just didn't this time. I was like, no. You ready? <laughs> I am ready. All right. You got all of, all of the things. All of the things. I did. Oh, I guess I have to place first, huh? You do. Awkward. Okay. So that's the only reason why I went and doubled up. I went da, all four da, on there. Da, 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 Why you gotta be like that, Dr. Glory Hog? Why can't you, why can't you give me that two glory? <laughs> I wonder why. Maybe it's because we're almost tied up? <laughs> all right. So you... You won both of these, so go ahead and put your flags down. Get your oh get your no, stuff. though I only actually have two flags left. Oh, so I can't. Well, even, you would just place them both there. on here, and you would tie yeah. here. But you would you would get this one either way. Right. I didn't even think about that. I didn't even really need to do that. I could have saved these fives for something else. What were these, anyways? Well, you couldn't save the fives for something else because I specifically put out my six here. So like you would have had to have chosen. I guess. That's or else true. you would have lost one of them. I hope you lose one of them. <laughs> now, before we go any further, I'm going to okay. use my Taskmaster card just so I can show everybody what it does. And I will just take these two resources, please. Thank oh, you very much. Oh, no. I hope Dr. those weren't Glory part of your plan. Hog. And Why? are you ready? Are you ready to battle? I'm ready to battle, yes. So five, six, seven, eight, and nine. I also have nine. And then I have two of these guards. And I also have this plus three. And I have... Plus 
plus one strength. So five, six, seven, eight, nine, well, first, 10, 11, 12 on that, right? First we decide how the battle in the middle works. So in the battle in the middle works, I'm attacking with 12. And you've got five, six, seven, eight, nine. So Ten. you are wiped out. Nope, because you're looking at, is it for attack? Right here, for strength. Okay, you're using for strength. So you've got five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and I've got twelve. So I've got two left. And my two left goes out and they hit your guards and, you know, unsuccessful. So nobody gets that glory. But these fangs were still furious. Look how furious they are. Nope, nope. Get your furious fangs out of here. Nope, right. nope, Dr. Glory Hog. <laughs> so rude, right? So rude, Amanda, right? Wow. Like, <laughs> she's already done this to me twice. <laughs> We won't talk about how she used one of these cards earlier that said one of your guard specialists gets a plus bonus and you did not have a guard oh, specialist. I we thought won't I talk did. about I it. I thought I did. It's okay. It's oh, okay. My oh, my goodness. Oh, my oh, goodness. Oh, we have to roll for the tie. <laughs> Julie says we roll for the tie. Just, we roll, oh, I guess you roll three die? I roll three die. This seems bad. Roll for the tie. Roll for the tie. Let's do this. Let's do this. Oh, yeah. This seems worse yeah. now. Seven. It's not bad. Four, three. five, six, seven, eight, nine. So you would get it. Da, da, get da, your da, glory. Da, 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 all right, now let's go ahead and trigger. Da, 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 da. <laughs> That's all I got because now I'm going to lose the game. <laughs> so. <laughs> all right, you ready to get your, your one honey? Your one I honey got buddy? my one honey. So delicious. So for this, I would get two glory. Oh, no, this one is a, is a null. This one is a null. But this one I'd get two. That one you do get two. And then I'm going to turn in. I'm going to buy. So I'm going to go one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven. I'm gonna buy glory because you can buy glory if you're willing to spend Get your the money glory. for it. Huh. And then that's it. I have All four right. left over. So do you feel like you've redeemed yourself on this playthrough, Doctor Glory? Huh? I don't know. Let me actually make you turn like, your question uh, into a question. Do okay. you feel like I redeemed myself? I do feel like you have become a very glorious person, a very a very glorious bear. I think. I feel like after this, I'm just gonna start like sprouting out back hair or something. It's just be like. <laughs> Bing, bing. You're just gonna become more bear -like. My beard is just gonna become part of my back. You're gonna become grizzled. Like I'm gonna be grizzly. honest with you guys. I don't really have any back hair, but maybe I will after this. <laughs> maybe I will. Hey, you know what? This this probably is not gonna come off. This is 15 year old face paint. Well, there so you go. You know what? That's gonna be it, with you for days. So good thing worth that it. we're working from home right now. So yeah. it's fantastical. Yeah. I can do whatever I want. Have you seen how let, how long I let my hair get because of quarantine? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I don't care. Well, thank you to everybody who joined us today. If you are interested in Barbarian. Bears beats Battlestar Galactica. If you're interested in the three Bs, <laughs> check out Kickstarter. That's right, because this Kickstarter is going on right now. And uh, since Julie is in chat, I believe that you guys opened up a new bear hero. There's bear heroes that come with this. Oh, yeah. Okay. This is the yes, base. Yes. There can be so much more. Like... Candy expansion. Which have special powers and stuff. Yeah, and you have the Candy Horde expansion that's available. This game has other things that are really exciting that you guys should go check out on their Kickstarter. So if you were not entertained, you can be more entertained <laughs> by getting extra stuff like heroes. If you like this video, make sure to like and subscribe to Board Game Spotlight's content. I know that Jimmy does some awesome work whenever he shows videos, and we're going to be doing more work as well. We also have, what else? Well, Amanda Panda was asking, how is this different from the oh, battle game? Okay, the biggest okay. thing that's different is there's more access to these types of cards. Here, hold on. Let me show what Sorry. you're pointing out there. Yeah, there you go. there's more access to these types of cards because there was just less card types before. Mm -hmm. There is also this adventure portion, which did not exist. This little area, Absolutely. control area that didn't exist. So that one was just a straight roll, attack each other, or build up resources, which for that one, the goal was really to get as many of these specialists as you could get a bunch of resources, unlock all your dice, and then just decimate your opponent with a bunch of Absolutely. attacks. Absolutely. And this one is a little bit more friendlier, where you're not taking tokens from people, because in As the much, original, right? yeah, you are taking the glory tokens specifically from people, whereas this one has a, a glory track here. So I think that it's like a little bit more friendlier, because sometimes people get like upset whenever things are being taken from right. them sometimes. Right, like when yeah. our kid was like, I think, eight at the time, the right. idea like of taking, little, little kid. taking a token from her, I mean, like, like she'd be like... She would fight to the death be like, I want back my glory token. I want back my red glory you token. You had to remember exactly which token it was that you took from She'd get mad. Yeah, from our little bear because man, like they wanted that exact token. I want there. my red glory token back. And plus it, you don't have the heroes in the original game. This is the heroes are something new that yes. they're adding with special powers, which is another exciting a whole feature. another aspect. 
Now, you were asking about what else we have planned. So next Monday, June the right. 29th, we will be playing Burnt Islands Games Into the Deep. That's right. So stay tuned for that. I'm super excited about it. Like, In Burnt a... Island Games, they make such great games. I'm so excited to If you have them. any questions, feel free to leave them in the comment section, and we'll come back to them. Absolutely. Other than that, we will see all of you next week. We appreciate everybody showing up and watching our game. Do your bare face. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>